You can see it. You ever, you ever have this happen? This is how confusing it is. This, this is the practical application of what I'm talking about. Like a guy be out, this happened to a lot of guys. You be out of club, bar, right? He's kicking with your boys, and, and a girl walks by, and, and man, she looks good. She looks good. Not good in that classical way. I mean, you know, I'm talking good. Like, she got half her ass hanging out her skirt. Mm. Her titties are all mashed together, <laughs> popping out the top of her turtleneck and shit. <laughs> and you with your buddies, right? You with your buddies, you got a couple drinks in you, and you see a girl like this, you might try to talk to her. This might not come out right. I don't know what you say, but <laughs> damn, look at them titties! <laughs> <All right. laughs> The girl gets mad and she oh, uh-uh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Just because I'm dressed this way does not make me a whore. Which is true. Gentlemen, that is true. Just because they dress a certain way doesn't mean they are a certain way. Don't ever forget it. But ladies, you must understand that that is fucking confusing. <laughs> Just ends. Now that would be like me, Dave Chappelle, the comedian, walking around the streets in a cop uniform. <laughs> Somebody might run up on me. Oh, thank God. Officer, help us. Come on, they're over here. Help us. I'm like, oh, just because I'm dressed this way <laughs> does not make me a police officer. You understand what I'm saying? I was like, all right, lady, fine, fine. You are not a whore. But you are wearing a whore's uniform, I'll tell you that shit right now. Right? <laughs> Little misunderstandings can happen. Clinton did the same thing, but he didn't do it like that. Because it's the year 2000, he's busier than Kennedy was. He was a busy man. Clinton did that kind of thing the way busy men do it. You know what busy men do? They fuck who's close to them. <laughs> I can tell that's what Clinton was up to. It looked like he just stuck his head out the office door and shit. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> you, you, come here, come here. <laughs> I need my penis up for my 330, come on. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> He's probably looking at Kennedy's picture and shit. Oh. Oh. And then to top it off, he lied, which I thought was just, I thought that was special. <laughs> I did, man. I know how he did. I've been accused of having sex with a girl I did not have sex with before. And let me tell you something, that shit is infuriating. <laughs> you ever go through that, you know, it'll make you crazy. You be screaming at your best friends. I didn't touch that bitch, nigga, I'll kill you. <laughs> Fuck you, nigga, I'll kill you. Please believe me. Please believe me. And Clinton didn't do it like that, did it? And Clinton came out of the press conference all relaxed, his shoulders all relaxed, he's in all this trouble. It looked like he just got done fucking or something. Uh. <laughs> Listen, let me tell you something, America. I don't think you heard me the first time. I did not have sexual relations with that woman, Miss <laughs> Lewinsky. And it's not even that bad of a joke. It's a true joke. I mean, it's not true, but I, I, I had read in the paper that Caitlyn Jenner was contemplating posing nude in an upcoming issue of Sports Illustrated. And I know it's not politically correct to say these things, so I just figured, fuck it, I'll say it for everybody else. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> you know, sometimes, I just want to read some stats. 
I don't know why you're gonna cram some man pussy in the middle of the sports page like this. I just didn't think that was the place for it. But I wasn't saying anything like Caitlyn Jenner's a bad person. I'm not mad at her for doing it. I'm not even mad at Sports Illustrated. If I'm mad at somebody, I'm probably just mad at myself. You understand? Because deep down, I know that I am not strong enough to not look at those pictures. <laughs> And I don't think I'm ready to see what she's trying to show me. <laughs> so, Caitlin, God damn it, if you go through with this thing, bitch, you better go hard or go home. <laughs> I want you to go all the way. Hustler style. Do you know what hustler style means, miss? That means spread the lips. I hope she spreads her lips and there's an itty bitty dick inside. Ah! <laughs> the show is behind the curtains. <laughs> I don't know what I said that upset that person. <laughs> 